Hi and welcome back to Ultrasign and uh, it's time for us to check out Serenia, a Norwegian-ish uh, um, symphonic-ish uh, me metal band. Um, they have uh, changed uh, style sometimes, but uh, this um, this track is from 2013, I think, and it's seven window sweep and um, we have listened to uh, not Serenia, but uh, we have listened to more team before on the channel, and uh, it's the same dude behind the band. So, um, well, classic music, or oh, yeah, for me. Um, how do, there, there, and let's go.
Yes, and uh, well, we lost Robert again. <laughs> Uh, uh, internet is a fantastic thing when it works. Don't you agree? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, Serena. Uh, well, that was Serena, and um, that also uh, a kind of sea cow, just uh, for you, so you know that. Uh, but um, yeah. Okay. This is. Uh, I, I like this. It's very well done. Uh, it's a nice track. <laughs> great production music and i think this is what if if carl orf had lived today this is the kind of music probably he would make it also kind of it has a lot of wagner in there with this uh, yeah. national romantic uh, heroism and mythology about the hardships of the people of the north. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's it, yeah, it, it. You know, um, when you live here, um, you can f almost sometimes think it's this uh, national romantic uh, uh, stuff is a bit. What do you call it? Lölig. Ridiculous. Uh, yeah, no, not ridiculous, not not, but uh, like, like a little bit weird, funny, but little embracing. You know, it's not uh, super serious when when you're from here. But uh, it's about tradition and storytelling. Yeah, but yeah, but I, I know from uh, aboard, uh, many people think this is very romantic, <laughs> and uh, for for me, I think it's well, you have. You have heard heard so much of it, and you you, you know. That's so what I mean. It's national romantic. It's, yeah. it's uh, about the the hard life in the north and crossing the rough seas, and you know, yeah. conquering and heroism, and it's it's the mythology of that. Yeah, this band in this track at least wants to. Celebrate. Yeah, but um, it's more about uh, sirens, I think, or or the weakness of uh, men that falls for the singing of sirens. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, but that's in. The... Th that's a part of it, of course. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah uh, well, beside the story, I my um, oh yeah, we had um, in this track we have. Um, in this part of uh, Serena, we had uh, the female vocalist uh, named Aelion, and I, I really, really loved, uh, I still like her voice, but I, um, her new band I don't um, like so much, you know, so it's, it's hard to enjoy her voice in it. In, uh, yeah, but in this track she played a big part, I think. Yeah, she, she does in all the tracks on, on the album that she was on, but... Uh, uh, they have uh, they are new for uh, change the female vocals quite often. Uh, mm -hmm. So so, but I really enjoyed her part on uh, uh, in Serena, and um, uh, she has something special in her voice. Not the most perfect singing, but she has, you know, this kind of when you really can get through how. How you should feel with your voice more than oh, it's a perfect singing harmony, perfect two tunes, and average. It's still good, but uh, there are many singers that are better, of course, but I think lack the emotion that she brings to it. Um, yeah. If you, if I, if you understand what I mean. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, well, Morten Wieland, I always in. Like his music, everything, every time, from Tristania to here, his uh, newest Motemia. Yeah. Um, so yeah. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Thank you, and uh, see you later. Bye. Bye.